Luis Hernandez was absolutely ridiculous. That's all I have to say. I could end the video right there, but it would not do him justice because this man was an absolute legend. I'm not just talking about a legend on Ultimate Team um, being through the icon system. I'm talking a legend for my Ultimate Team, Beast FC. During FIFA 18, at the start, I struggled quite a lot. I didn't really have a main striker. I think I had Mikel Antonio, who was um, scoring goals. You know, he was scoring, but not at the rate Luis Hernandez did when I packed him over Christmas. So, I packed Hernandez over Christmas in a free car pack from EA. Thanks, EA, for that one. It was the luckiest pull I've ever, uh, I've ever done in my life. Um, and it led to just fantastic things for my club and Luis Hernandez. I know it's sad that I'm talking about fake cards on a on a fake well on a, on a computer football game, but honestly, I had so much fun with this card. Um, if you ever consider him for your future team, then please do because he was amazing on FIFA 18. He was incredible. Um, maybe it was because of the game and how it was built you know, from pace and that, but Luis Hernandez's pace was electric. You could not stop the guy. He was so fast. He wasn't strong, but he was so fast. He reminded, reminds me of like FIFA 19 sort of Sterling, where like Sterling could just run out a strong defender and just get past him because of like how nimble they are. And you know, it's just, oh, his pace was just blistering. He had 89 dribbling as well, which which really helped with those runs as well. You could literally skip past defenders. And he also had 88 shot. So if you put a hawk on that bad boy, you're definitely scoring some goals. And Luis Hernandez scored some crazy finesse goals. He even scored a couple of overheads, um, a few tap-ins and stuff. Um, for my club, Luis Hernandez, uh, he played 556 games and scored a whopping 540 goals and got 250 assists. That is insane. I know what you're thinking. You're probably like, oh, he's an icon. He's supposed to do that. But those numbers are unreal. And I played, and that's probably the reason why I played FIFA 18 so much. It's because I love that card. And Luis Hernandez will always be one of the best FIFA cards I've ever used. I mean, we talk about, if you talk about sort of what I did with MNEK on FIFA 15. Okay, that is more impressive because, you know, in a in a sense, like because uh, he was a, a just a rare gold card, so he shouldn't have been. But that was because the game and his card was broken. Luis Hernandez was built to be like this, and all oh my days, he was just an absolute joy to use on FIFA 18. And I hope that, like I said, if you ever use him in the future. Please do. Please try him on FIFA 20. You know, FIFA 20 does value pace, so Luis Hernandez will be pretty incredible for that. Um, when I rolled into FIFA 19, I didn't use him, sadly. I used um, uh, other icons, which we'll get round to in another video. But yeah, Luis Hernandez, absolutely insane, absolutely incredible, and I hope that I can use him again in future FIFAs.